Hello, this is Dr. Gay from First Second MRI. And this is a 57-year-old male with complaints of headaches. His brain looks pretty good overall, a couple minimal findings. And one of the findings, which is probably incidental, is a benign venous anomaly, a benign venous malformation. We call this a venous angioma. And it's fairly common. We can see it here in the right cerebellar hemisphere. Here's the left cerebellum, right cerebellum. Here's the back of the head. Here's the nose up front to get oriented. And this venous anomaly is a prominent draining vein that comes up, up, up here, and it drains into the dura, a dural vein. And then this is a sinus over here, dural venous sinus. And usually these have several smaller veins that drain into them, and they call it the caput medusa sign. It looks like Medusa's head with snakes, um, these little blood vessels coming together to converge into the dominant vessel. Or you can call it palm tree appearance, where it looks like palm branches coming into the palm tree here. But again, these are typically benign venous anomalies. It's very rare that they have any trouble. Sometimes they can be associated with other uh, vascular anomalies like cavernous angiomas, and when that's the case, they have a, um, a propensity to possibly bleed. Sometimes they can get thrombosed and then lead to a bleed. But again, when there are pure venous anomalies like this, they're typically asymptomatic. And we just make note of them, and here's what it looks like on a coronal view. So here's the caput medusa coming together, these small vessels converging. And here's that dominant vessel going up over here to a dural vein. Here's a transverse sinus over here. And there's that vein. It looks like it may have another drainage here immediately as well. But this is a benign developmental venous anomaly called a venous angioma, and it probably is incidental in this patient. Thank you very much.